How's it going guys, Ilya Ftinan here and welcome to the A9 Were theme of the match day Usman Dembele pre-review. So as you lot might be aware, France have won the World Cup and uh, congratulations to them and obviously the French people and uh, it is a big thing because this is the, the second time and uh, it does obviously mean a lot to them as we could see from the celebrations. And uh, we got another team of the match there which we were meant to get. I wasn't expecting a complete French side to be honest. I thought it would be a mixture of Croatian and French players. However, we still get you know great content because obviously a lot of players that have got themselves a uh, team of the match they didn't contribute a lot to the national team but you know also some of them haven't got themselves any special card for example this guy right here but this is his first one and this is quite awesome if you look at it i mean he's got himself 95 pace 86 shooting 84 passing 93 dribbling and 70 65 physical it does look quite fantastic i mean if you've used it you do know how good it is and then he's also got himself five star skin moves with five star weak fit which obviously is very very usable I mean, if you'd like to perform a lot of skill moves, obviously, 5-star skiller is the best. And then he's got himself high low work rate, which obviously is the best for offensive player. And I mean, on the whole, this card looks great, and it is quite decently priced. If you look further into the card, obviously, it does look very good. It doesn't look as great as the other cards that we have got. Obviously, this is his first, uh, what do you call it, a special card, so he doesn't have as great stats, but obviously, they're still good. If you look at them, pace is very explosive. We can see that, you know, quite electrifying, 97 acceleration with 92 sprint speed. His shooting... It's very great, but you know, it's not the best, obviously. Positioning is 88, finishing is 87, and shot power is 93. It's not bad, obviously, it's quite good. Long shots, however, they are not the best, you know, so you cannot not take a lot of long shots. They look very poor. And his passing is also quite decent, to be honest. 94 vision, 86 crossing, and then 87 curve, quite decent. And then his dribbling is quite fantastic, to be honest. 95 agility, 95 balance, 86 reactions, 89 ball control, and 97 dribbling itself. Composure, however, does look very poor as well you know i mean it's only 77 so it might be a problem when you run with him you know at the when you have the ball at his feet but that can be seen when we look at the game play his uh, ability when it comes to setting is also quite decent not the best however his physicality on a whole does look very poor to be honest stamina is decent but strength and aggression are quite low but on a whole this card does look quite good you know not the best but still very very great and fun and for me obviously this card was a lot of fun i tried him on various positions you know obviously he's a right mid but you can also play him right winger right forward and uh, also Cam, in my opinion, and I had him on all of those positions, you know, in every match. And uh, he did feel very good. He's quite good at some of the things that he does. Like I said, he doesn't have the best of stats. And they are obviously felt in the game. So he's not the best of cards out there, but he's still very, very fun. And obviously that 5-star skill move, you know, with that 5-star weak foot combo is very, very useful. And he's very great at that. I'm someone that, you know, is not that good at 5-star skill moves. So I didn't do a lot of skill moves. I did try a lot of them, you know, but the end product wasn't there. Obviously, it was getting away too much. But on a whole, you got that guy. Is this how it is very, very good? You can see here, you know, I was able to perform some of the skill moves and just create space. And his dribbling is so great that the ball in his feet is very, very fun to have, you know, not only fun, but he's just very great. You know, he can be a great playmaker, in my opinion. And if you look at his positives, that's what they the most for me. It was his pace, his jewelry, his finishing, and his dribbling on a whole. If you look at his pace, like I said, quite electrifying. You know, he's very nice, he's got himself very great. Uh, acceleration and the uh, sprint speed itself so he's very easy to drift fight his agility is just phenomenal you know it's 95 with the 95 balance so he's also very great when it comes to you know going uh, moving around quickly and that can be felt like very great his ball control isn't the best obviously i mean it's not the highest it's 89 but it's you know it's very good since he's got himself 97 dribbling he doesn't lose the ball you know he's very great with the ball and speed and i mean just moving around is quite good with him and then on a whole, this card is great. Like I said, his passing is also very, very good. Does You know, his crossing is also quite good. It's 86, so that's nice to see. His negatives are his heading, his strength, his composure, and long shots. His heading is very bad. His strength is very bad. Obviously, his physicality is quite low. And then his composure. After a while, you know, in the second half, you can feel that he's not as composed. I don't know. There was some reason that he, was, he wasn't he was being, you know, as good with the ball in his feet as he was in the first half. So that was something very noticeable, you know, and that was something very bad to see, obviously. But the cards, I think, are quite similar. I promise and Sun, you know, promise does look very, very similar. And also Sun, when it comes to the movement, because, you know, they've got long steps, so they do look, look quite similar. However, this card is quite good, to be honest, for the price that it's going. I do expect it to drop, you know, because footies are coming out very soon, so people might be, you know obviously selling the cards for like saving the money but i think this card is quite fun and if you can buy this card obviously buy it and try it but that was this video guys hope you've enjoyed it don't forget to like subscribe and share and i'll see you guys in the next one